guys, today we're gonna to be talking about slow growers. In case you just had a hair transplant, maybe you're on month two or three, and you're looking at the mirror and thinking, when the hell am I gonna start seeing growth? This video is for you. I'm gonna give you guys a couple of examples so that you don't freak out at month three. Also, in case you just had a hair transplant or you're wondering and wanna research hair transplants, I'm gonna go ahead and link the Hair Restoration Network discussion forum in the description box, guys. In case you haven't registered, I highly, highly suggest checking it out. It's free, you get to see what real hair transplants look like, and it's a good community of guys willing to share their experiences. All right, now let's get started. All right, so I'm gonna share a couple of examples from our forum with you guys so that you see, guys, it didn't look that good at three months, four months, even five months. And then you see their progression and why it's so important to wait the full 12 months before passing judgment or just freaking out about your hair transplant. Trust me, easier said than done. I know I've been through it three times, so I know if you guys are on the other side of the screen saying, easy for you to say, man, my hair isn't growing. I spent thousands of dollars. What the heck is going on? Relax, I get it. I know what you're going through. There's no need to panic. Also, in case you guys just want to go and look at these results yourself, feel free to go on the forum. Like I said, it's free. It's just a good source of information. So the first example is a good example of a guy whose hair started growing later. But not only that, the texture changed as the time went on. So in the beginning, when your hair starts to grow, it may come out looking a little curly, a little coarse. But as the months progress, not only will the hair mature and thicken, but it'll start to refine as well. So let's get into that example. So this next example is a guy who not only grew a little bit slower than the average guy, but he also suffered shock loss. So he actually looked a little worse after surgery than he did before his surgery, which is actually very common. So if you're going through that, just stay patient. Now let's get into that example. All right guys, so just before I close out this video, I wanna say in case you're going through a hair transplant, right now it's month three or month four, or even month five and you're starting to freak out and you're thinking, damn, did I make a mistake? Is my hair transplant gonna be a failure? All I'm gonna say is stay patient, trust in the process. If you did the research and you chose a good surgeon, chances are your hair transplant is going to be successful. Hair follicles are independent, so they grow whenever they want to grow. So you may see one side growing faster than the other side. That's completely normal. Unfortunately, there's nothing that we can do to really speed up the process. All you can do really is give it time. Um, well, I hope you guys found this video informative. And if you did, I would really appreciate it if you guys were to go ahead and give the video a like. And if you like the content that I put on this channel, I would highly appreciate it if you guys would go ahead and subscribe. And if you think anyone would benefit from this video or one of your friends or something just had a hair transplant, please share it with them. All right, till next time.